First of all, I want to thank everyone. With all your support, my subscribers have reached almost 500 today. So I will hold a special hidden character giveaway event in today's video. I will hide free students in this video. If you find one of them, you can message me in Discord with the proof of your findings. Remember to send me the proof as soon as you find her as the reward is given by the first finder only. Enough explanation and the contest starts now. You could find the free hidden students at any time after. Summer Sky's wishlist banner opens at the beginning of the 6th month of server and lasts 2 weeks. The first student is Azusa Swimsuit. She is a must draw for free to play. She is a complete and absolute god student, a strategic weapon with a high multiplier and armor breaking that is perfect for destroying any mysterious armor enemy. The game would be quite difficult without her. The advantage of Azusa Swimsuit is up to 1496% X skill multiplier, long duration of the passive skill to reduce defense, and a normal skill to increase critical damage. She is the absolute core of all mystical total assaults, the ceiling against the single mystic target. Her disadvantage is that her normal skill trigger randomization may affect the timing of your team's active skill release, but in reality, it doesn't have much impact, other than that there are no disadvantages. Even if you want to say that she does not do enough damage to the group enemies, but she still did tons of damage when fighting Paoro who is the mystic boss with the ability to summon millions of minions in the Japanese server. She doesn't join the regular banner after the event and she doesn't have other ways to obtain her shards. So free to play don't wait. This is your only chance to get her. The second student you can draw from this event is Mashiro Swimsuit. I don't recommend free to play to draw her. The reason for this is simply that she is not very versatile and designed for the arena specifically. That is why her nickname is Tsubaki Killer. Pros, her skill reduces the enemy's evasion rate, increases your team's accuracy, and she is the only strong counterpick to the front row of mystic armor enemy in the arena, and can directly replace the front row of your arena team to deal with Tsubaki. Disadvantages, her use is very limited, and it is not very effective in total assaults or in the campaign. Acquisition, same as Azusa Swimsuit. This is your only chance to get her. But I still don't recommend free to play to get her. The next banner is Vision of the Sprinting Sunflower. It opens in the late 6 months of the server. The new student is Haifumi Swimsuit. I don't recommend free to play to draw her. Her main purpose is providing damage in the extreme difficulty total assault. You can try to get her if you have a need for the total assault reward. Advantages, the first student with the new mechanism. Pay a lot of costs to get a tank that lasts 50 seconds. The tank can provide AoE damage with the penetration attribute. The tank's normal attack is a great way to deal damage to a single target. After the opening of the ninth level of the base defense, she has an excellent performance. A reliable damage dealer to hit the back row enemies in the total assault against Chisad. The disadvantage, 10 cost X skill, a full bar of cost, also need a long time to have a good damage output. She is not a good choice for the arena or campaign. Again this is the only chance to get her. No other way to get her. That is it for today's video. I hope everyone has good luck with treasure hunting and happy gaming. Peace out.